All right, let's explore a little more of this place. You know, all the dead Elsters there kind of insinuates that this isn't the first time we've come here. And it's not the first time we've been kicked down the elevator shaft. Oh, right, I just got a key for that. You know, of course, because things weren't confusing enough. Oh, where am I now? What is this place? Flood overflow. Oh. Alright. Service level is the floor we're on. What is, does this take us down to six? It does. Staff accommodations. Can we go down even further? Oh man, they're, they're really piling up. Aren't they? That's also why the elevator hasn't been working. 5112 post box key required. Okay. Well, I'm not sure which one I would even want to get into. What if I went down? I wonder how far down I can go this way. Okay, this goes all the way down to seven. It unlocks from the other side. Okay. What about eight? Oh boy. Hoffnung für die Zukunft. Rotfront. Hope for the future, Rotfront. Well, I guess that's the name of that city, but. Hey, now I've been as far down as the late, but, uh, controller on combinations and protector combinations. Well, alright. Suppose I should explore six a bit. What do I have in my inventory? I have some more pistol ammo and I have some of these flares. Okay, that's locked. Owl key required. Oh. What do we have here? STCR Security Technician Controller Replica Storch Okay Bayern Bayern will burn Is that a different city? Okay, I'll take that Angry Notes I am officially sick of the Yules next door They've been listening to that stupid song non-stop since the piano room was locked down. If I have to hear it one more time, I'm going over there and smashing that stupid tape recorder to pieces. I wonder if there's a way we can borrow a key so we can get into their dorm and put an end to this madness. I don't care about breaking quarantine if it means never having to hear that song again. What song is it? Uh -huh. This place seems kind of fancy. Oh, uh, nothing down here. Uh, well, there's that. Oh man, it doesn't look good. That doesn't really look good. Can I just alert one of them by any chance? That guy seems to be the most threatening. Oh, it's got a shield too. That's unfortunate. It's not fair at all. Okay, uh... Stop blocking. Okay, I took care of those guys. 
Can I use the flare like this? No, apparently not. I had to try it. What is this? Dark Souls or something? Use that. How do I... Okay, I can't juke it very easily with, like that. Okay, um... Okay. So now can I burn it? I can. Okay. So I don't have to worry about that one coming back anymore. At least I shouldn't have to worry about that. Because I can handle the other two pretty easily. Though I'm not sure if this will be a thoroughfare I'll go through very often. Maybe. And star. Replica overview. Star. Star. Security technician guard replica. Starling. Type. Generation 4 low cost combat unit frame biomechanical with polyethylene shell and bullet resistant armor plating height 220 centimeters the standard model of the protector security technicians fitted with extended legs star units gracefully tower over most uh, gestalts despite their heavy armor they can move swiftly with their long stride all right. Their cool and detached demeanor allows them to analyze situations with objectivity and deploy force as required. Trained in close combat and riot control techniques, they operate best in small squads led by an officer star unit equipped with a ballistic shield. Oh. I'm guessing that's what I uh, just fought just now. So, I guess it's some sort of disease that affects both the replicas and the people. I don't know if I've been killing both uh, replicas and people. Or, well, I guess they're not either anymore, but I'm going to probably just use that right now. This is kind of dark. Okay, well that ain't good. Let's leave. I do not have a... To my knowledge, I don't have any source of light. I should reload. Did I reload? How do I reload? Oh, that's how I reload. Okay. Let's see what's down here. Repair patch. Memorandum lighting malfunctions. To service cadre from Arar S2316. Due to a recent incident involving a certain starling that shall remain unnamed, I've adjusted all doors to require visible light to open. Alright. This should hopefully stop any more non-service. Is that cadre, cater? How do you pronounce that? Personnel from endangering themselves by stumbling into dark rooms until we can take care of the lighting issues. All right, well, I stumbled into a dark room just a few minutes ago. If you've been assigned an illumination failure repair task, remember to equip a flashlight module so the door sensors will let you in. Alright, are you going to tell me uh, where I can find one? Ask Adler ahead 
Oh. Uh, ask Adler ahead of time if you need one. He's usually in his quarters on the eighth floor these days. Sekzen. Sekzen. Well, I already met Adler, and he didn't seem like the type who'd be willing to just hand me a flashlight. Oh, that ain't good. Oh. Uh. Okay, I can't go to the right. Uh. Uh, I can't go down there either. Oh, that's unfortunate. I can't go up there. I can go down here. Is it any safer down here? There's a disposable stun prod. That's useful in emergencies. Era, era. I think I. Uh, I think I found that before. That kind of rings a bell, actually. Oh, there's a hole that goes down, probably to the other next floor. Replica overview. Era. Era. Ara. All-purpose repair worker replica macaw. Type generation two low, um, cost general purpose. Frame biomechanical with titanium reinforced polyethylene shell, height 185 centimeters. The tough worker bees of the construction and repair industry. One of the earlier replica designs, the simple but efficient uh, ARAs are actually the most produced replica type to date. These strong and heavy worker units are a perfect fit for work in construction and production of industrial goods. In many places throughout our nation, ARAs have already replaced all gestalt workers in fields like uh, clima forming and explosive ordnance disposal. Alright, so they're uh, taking our jobs. I see how it is. Do they get paid? Oh my god. Where'd you come from? The floor? Yeah, I guess. You probably did, huh? Oh man. Okay. Well, that was rude. I'll take these. <clears throat> I don't think there's anything else here. There's the way down there, which... I don't know. Can I go to the left here? Okay. Uh... Nope. That's not an option. Oh, man. I, I got both of them with one. That's cool. Um, since this one's a little tougher, do I want to use a flare on it? I'll think about it, maybe. If I come here often, anyway. Okay. Um... What if I dropped down? Oh. I'm afraid the commander won't receive any visitors at the moment. But perhaps I can be of assistance instead. Who are you? I'm the administrator of this facility. Please, there's no need to be afraid. 
I'm just here to help. Erica, none of us are here by choice. Und niemand wird. Oh. I don't have any space for the repair spray. Really? That's a star dorm. Oh, hi. Oh, no. Ain't good. I'm kinda I'm kinda hurting from that. Let's use this. Um I'll take another auto injector, I guess. And I'll take the repair spray. Star. Uh alright. More propaganda, I guess. Is it me or does a lot of this just seem like fascist propaganda? <laughs> I don't know. I I I I have a a bad feeling about this this uh, nation. Are those the three stars of the nation again? I'm at, I'm at heart of the revolution. Locked the door. Where are we now? Hey, at least I'm getting more shotgun rounds. There's a looping lift over there. Okay. We got some kind of regular enemies in here, so I'm not too worried about that. I dealt with them. How am I on ammo? Oh, I gotta reload. Do I have any ammo left? Thought I did. Am I out actually? Oh dang, I am out of that. That's uh. Well, here we got got some more just now. I must have put that in my gun automatically. Or, oh, only two bullets. I thought I had more bullets than that for some reason. This is the cafeteria, the dining room. Yeah. Kitez. Uh, Kitez awaits liberation. What's their idea of liberation, though? Like, do they liberate places by, uh, you know, doing a bunch of mortar strikes? That's kind of what this picture looks like. Or even worse like missiles perhaps oh no space to carry fuse high voltage fuse your order for this replacement part has been approved and was processed by s23 management please find and close the requested part for installation Falk has specifically requested that the repair of the looping lift system be prioritized over other repairs. Please replace the fuse as soon as possible. It is a huge hassle for everyone to get around without it. Well, it sounds like it'll be pretty important for me as well, but I don't have space for it right now. There's various half-eaten rations on the table. I'm not hungry. It looks like a 
Well, I guess that's all just food and stuff. Nothing I can use right now. Yeah, my inventory is full. What if I put something to uh, a shortcut? No. Alright, doesn't make a difference. Well, this isn't great, is it, actually? Um. Okay, uh... Oh, it's another dark room. Okay, uh, no thank you. Oh, some more bullets. The... Paternoster lift system seems to be powered down. I wonder if there's a way to turn it on. Oh, that's what these are. They're lifts. Okay. Oh, there's a room of darkness. I'm out of bullets again. Well, no, I still have one bullet left. Okay. The door is locked with a reinforced rolling shutter gate. I need a fitting shutter gate handle to open it. Oh no, is it, is it gonna find me here? I don't have any more stun prods either. Okay, oh no. Run. Oh god, that's even worse. That is even worse. I need to find some sort of salvation here. I don't have like any way to defend myself. Oh, I didn't mean to use that. Well, I'm in good shape now at least. Is there like a way I can punch things? I don't think there is. Star Security Technician Guard of Gastar S2313 uh, Hunter. Um, I see, that must be what's written on that one. Can I sneak behind this thing without it noticing? Protector units store their personal belongings in these lockers. There's nothing of interest for me. Okay! Leave me alone. Oh, there's bullets there. Oh, God. Okay, I can push it. I can push him. Um, I don't see anything else of use here, though. Okay, there's another... Shield... Guy here. Uh, let's go up here. Okay, that does not look good. I don't know what to make of that. What did this do? I think I'm, I think I'm glitching out a bit here. Okay. My radio got turned on all of a sudden. Oh, cool. Alright, this game's getting a little more intense. I see. I'm into it. Um. Dang, if I could take that 
guy out and burn it because I, I probably do want to get rid of all of the shielded ones because they're kind of annoying aren't they yeah I don't know why my radio turned on all of a sudden Oh, safe haven. Mm. Let's put this away for now. And take the shotgun out. Store all those. I don't think I need the auto injector at the moment. Okay. Let's equip the shotgun here and let's load it. Save it. Okay, so we gotta get that fuse, and I probably wanna, well, I might wanna burn that shield dude, just so I don't have to deal with him. This is six, so, um... That's unfortunate. Oh, this is the wrong way. Wrong floor. I guess I really did not. I thought I'd be able to take that thing out more easily. Do I have any ammo? Other than some, oh, I have one more bullet, I guess. Ah, it's not even worth it. I'll take the pistol back out for now. So if I load it, will it put in... Okay. It keeps the amount of bullets that it had. So that's nice. Uh, I don't remember where the fuse was. No, I guess not. 
Oh, that's how you push it, I forgot. Let's burn this thing. I don't want to have to deal with it anymore, but I'm in kind of bad shape. 160. Okay, am I supposed to set it to 160 then? Uh, here. Uh, okay. All right, I did what you wanted. I don't know what that does. Oh, did I get it? Oh, it's that island. There's a keyhole in the painting. Weird. Is there any uh, health items or anything like that? I'm in kind of rough shape. I already checked this out down here though. Okay, never mind, I'm I'm leaving. I'll die in a few more hits. So Oh god. I think it might have been the dining room that had the fuse, but I could be wrong. No! Now I'm really almost dead. Alright, well I was right about the fuse being here. Yes. gotta be somewhere that I put the fuse well I should go back up and use whatever healing items I have left probably well I go to the fuse box that's what I should do Okay, no, yeah, I don't want to go in there right now. Looks like maybe I heal a little bit after some time. Ugh. But obviously I can't take that many hits. Go back up to the fifth floor here. I guess I'll take those. And equip the auto injector. Okay. Use fuse, use fuse. All right, no. Okay, I see this is a, we just needed to match the volts here.
And there's some switches on the bottom. That's 120. Goes to 240. Oh boy. I'm not great at math. Especially math in my head. Well, that actually brings that one up and brings that one down. Are, do these numbers mean anything? Can't quite. Till so that goes twenty. Looks like it does. Um, hmm. That brings that one all the way down to zero. do oh I'm guessing we flip that once we figure it out is there anything else I can interact with here oh does that reset it or something I don't know what that just did it looks like it kind of just resets it Okay, so well, this is 120 volts, 120 volts. Okay, oh, yeah, I think this does make some sense here. Kind of. Oh, A, B. Oh, this is like a math puzzle. I still can't say I'm sure how it works yet. Is there like any sort of explanation as to how it works? Because I don't believe uh, that uh, mm. so the one on top it goes from 120 to 720 so it just adds 600 up top and then the one on bottom goes from 120 to 240. So that's. Uh, it adds like another 120, I guess. But how? Like, I feel like these numbers and stuff are important. Or do I just need to memorize which ones do what? Because I get that it starts at 120 volts. I don't know if these numbers or these knobs or anything like that does anything different. So it looks like the, oh wait, oh, I'm starting to understand it. So these seem to be 
things that subtract the number of volts. As you can see, this takes away 100 from the 120, and well, they both, uh, and that only takes away 10. Okay. So if that's 20 right there, um, what does that do? Okay, so that just adds 20. So there's, uh, these means they add it. Does this mean it, um, multiplies it or something? Because this is like. Yeah, so that's like 100, 120 times 2, 240. Okay. Um, I think I'm starting to understand it. So, now that we kind of have a basic understanding of how this works, we can maybe figure out what we need. Because we need to get the one up top to 800 so um, that takes it up to 720 and uh, that would bring it up to 800 but we also need uh, 230 on the bottom which could be an issue for us. Um, so, that'll bring it up to. Um, well, I don't know if it multiplies because. If it multiplied the number of volts that are already there, that would bring it up to, like, only 150. So I'm not sure how that works. I don't know. Um, didn't mean to flip that. Alright guys, I'm going to pull out a calculator and uh, cut until and I start to get a better grasp of how this works. Okay guys, I'm starting to see how this works a little more. Um, so, this is 220 times 2 is 240. And, you know, that multiplies that number to 720. Now, because I had this uh, switched up, it actually subtracts that. It subtracts uh, 190 from this number here. So that's why it was 530 before. Um, so if I go, um, that brings that up to 720. Um, add 80, that's 800. And that also subtracted from this number initially. Um, but if I switch this, it's not going to change the amount of power that's going into it. It just means that this is still subtracting from that. Mm. This is a kind of a, a tricky one. I go 
plus 250. Times uh, two is two seventy. Well, that's two ten, but four hundred. Okay. Um, is there any other way we can get eight hundred up top there? Because then if we subtracted 60, then that would get a little smaller, and then that's too much subtraction. And this will bring the one on the bottom to 230. Oh! I think I did it. All right. I got it. That was a doozy, but I did it. Only had to pull out a calculator once. All right. Well, now I got that up and running. I'm probably gonna just save it here for now. Save it and continue in the next episode.